What's up my friends? Welcome to another video. I'm Rob Stewart and I'm here to help you get your skin and your overall health back on track. So I know on this channel we hyper focus a lot on the gut biome, on the diet, on what foods to eat, and what foods to avoid when naturally trying to heal your skin. In today's video though, I'm going to be sharing with you guys 10 strange tools that are highly effective for naturally healing the skin that have nothing to do with diet or nutrition or cleansing or detox. One of the skills that you have to master in order to naturally heal your skin is daily movement and the movement of your lymphatic system. It has to be done every single day. These tools will majorly help benefit that. So rebounding, as cliche and 1985 as it sounds, doing some rebounding on a daily basis is a absolutely amazing way to have a healthy lymphatic system and to open up the pathways of elimination so the cleansing and the diet can work. Rebounding is awesome. Oh, a kettlebell will do you super well. You can buy one kettlebell and work out your entire body totally change your muscularity. This is a 75 pounder right here. You can bring a kettlebell everywhere with you. You can knock out a workout in like 10 to 15 minutes. You can touch every muscle in your entire body. It's very functional. It's very supportive for good posture. It's great for muscularity. It's great for losing weight. It is an amazing tool for lymphatic and overall health. I suggest kettlebells for everybody. If you can't find kettlebells, dumbbells are almost better. You can get a variety of different weights for relatively cheap you never even really need to go to a gym to stay healthy you can bring them to a park you can bring them to the whatever do it in your garage I don't care and if you have not done it before buy yourself a juve juve UV light for my clients has been really amazing I also like to enjoy it on a daily basis especially because I don't have access right now to a sauna or a place to do a proper cold exposure so I can turn my bathroom into a place where I can do red light therapy, I can do sauna, I can do cold exposure, I can do breath work, it's like a, my own little personal haven. Buy a backpack, a backpack like a rucking backpack that has a strap around the waist and a strap right here so that it can be really tight and can carry some weight and go rucking. A backpack has multiple uses and can be used as a lymphatic exercise tool in multiple, multiple ways get a backpack. I use my backpack every single day. Walk to get groceries, fill it up, walk back, amazing. An exfoliating mitt like this one does major, major benefits, both for the surface of the skin and for the lymphatic system. Super helpful when you're trying to get rid of the old skin cells. Opening up the pathways of elimination for those skin cells to leave, super helpful. This thing is cheap, it lasts forever, and it is a great tool. I use it almost every time I'm in the shower. Good old fashioned dry brush for lymphatic health, for exfoliating the skin gently, for moving the lymphatic system manually. There's really nothing like it. A pull-up bar or just somewhere to hang whenever you feel like it. There is so much that hanging does for your lymphatic system, for your spine health, for your digestion. Hanging is one of the most underrated exercises you can possibly do. Again, it's cheap, it's simple, it's easy. Why not? Now, quick note, you guys, I'm not saying that you need to do all of these things all of the time. Pick whatever ones of these tools that you enjoy or that you're interested in and play with it. And if you get bored with it, then try a different tool. The more of these tools you can stack on a regular basis and the more of these tools you master, the faster you're gonna heal your skin. And one of my favorites of all time, the gymnastics rings. In my opinion, there is no cheaper or more effective way to have a healthy upper body than gymnastics rings. A healthy upper body is a healthy lymphatic system. A healthy lymphatic system is healthy skin. Can't get more American than a bike. Whatever type of bike you like, a beachcomber, a 10 speed, a mountain bike, whatever, cycling, it's low impact, it's great for the knees, it's great for the lymphatic system, it uses the biggest muscles of your body, and it is awesome cardiovascularly, super safe, super accessible, a bike is a no-brainer. Remember guys, keep it fun, keep it light. Lymphatic movement in these tools are about making the healing process easier, not harder. And I am saving my favorite tool for last. A sled. 
and you can make a sled for like $15 with some rope and some plastic. And a sled is something that you can push, that you can pull, that you can run with, that you can drag. Humans are meant to crawl, to climb, to sprint, to walk backwards, to bend over, to lift things up, and to push and pull objects that are heavy on the ground. The more you do that, the more it balances your entire system lymphatically, with your joints, with your muscularity. It brings balance to the body and it has all of the elements you're looking for. It's cardiovascularly challenging, it's metabolically challenging, it can build lean muscle, it will burn fat, and functionally it keeps everything healthy. Sled pulling is one of my favorite all-time lymphatic tools. Give it a try. Thanks so much for watching today, guys. Remember to leave all of your comments and questions down below. For those of you who are looking for online coaching, there's a link in the description box for that. There's also a link in the description box for Skinessa, which is by far the world's best probiotic. Also down in the description box, you can find a link for the Three Phases Workbook, which is the step-by-step -step guide for naturally healing the skin. I'll be back with many more videos really soon. Peace.